विद्य दाति विनयम विनयाद याति पात्रताम पात्रत्वाद धनमापनोति धनाद धर्मम ततः सुखम नॉलेज गिव्स ह्यूमिलिटी फ्रॉम ह्यूमिलिटी वन अटेन्स कैरेक्टर फ्रॉम कैरेक्टर वन अक्वायर्स वेल्थ फ्रॉम वेल्थ गुड डीड्स फॉलो एंड देन हैप्पीनेस एस चांद celebrating 75 years in the field of publishing a celebration of the rich legacy of an institution that has always reached out to society today the high soaring flag of s chand is the outcome of an enlightened vision strong principles and undeterred focus that strong vision began with a single step that momentous step by shri shyam lal gupta had far reaching results for the publishing industry in india he joined his uncle at his bookshop in the year 1931 and went on to found s chand in 1939 s chand decided to publish education books by indian authors and provide them at reasonable prices to students S Chand's first sales office was opened at My Haran Gate in Jalandhar. 1954 saw the head office of the company opening at Asafali Road, Delhi. Spreading its roots, it started to make its presence felt both in national and international markets, with the first overseas sales happening in Cairo, Egypt in 1961. With tremendous foresight, S Chand started its own printing press the same year starting with monotype printing press offset machines introduced in the late 1960s facilitated a threefold output in 1969 babuji was honored with the padma shri award by the president of india dr zakir hussain for his outstanding contribution to the cause of indian publishing pressing forward its international presence S Chand participated in the Frankfurt Book Fair for the first time in 1969. As a member of Rajya Sabha, Shyamlal ji ensured the status of an industry for Indian publishing. 1973 saw Babu ji getting unanimously elected as the founder president of the Federation of Indian Publishers. S Chand successfully forayed into the arena of publishing school books. with a today series in 1976 with use of computers also mooted economic efficiency of s chand took an upturn in 1981 s chand ventured into the field of comic books with chitra bharati and katha mala which were immediate best sellers the company's catalog of books kept getting enriched with trade books competition books encyclopedias and comics Between 1982 and 1987, two two-color machines and a four-color machine were inducted into the press. They enabled the printing of 5,000 sheets per hour. A new feather was added in S. Chand's cap when it won the coveted Capixel Award for Exports in 1986. S. Chand celebrated its golden jubilee in 1987 with an all-time high of publishing. 4000 titles supported by their loyal and competent staff Mr Rajendra Kumar Gupta and Mr Ravindra Gupta carried forward its great legacy to reach new heights on 22nd August 1991 Babu ji was honored posthumously with the Indian Publishing Hall of Fame award by Dr Manmohan Singh the present Prime Minister of India in 1993 Mr Rajendra Gupta spearheaded the setting up of S Chand's export division S Chand International. Today, with Nigeria being the biggest buyer in Africa, the company's major export markets are the Middle East and Southeast Asia. 1996 saw S Chand joining hands with the prestigious Encyclopedia Britannica Incorporation, Chicago, to publish and distribute the Britannica products. in the entire indian subcontinent the same year s chand also declared a war on piracy by introducing the use of holograms 
As S. John stepped into the 21st century, it introduced its first website, schandgroup.com, in order to widen its reach. Continuing to gain accolades and recognition from various quarters, Mr. Ravindra Gupta was honoured with the prestigious Lifetime Achievement Award and the Federation of Indian Publishers Award 2001 for his contribution to book promotion and publishing. S. Chand was also honoured with the prestigious International Star Award for Quality and Excellence, Geneva 2001. In 2002, S. Chand became the first recipient of the UGC Best Publisher Award. It also became the proud receiver of the first ever FPBAI Publisher Award in 2005. The year 2006 was a game changer year with an impactful entry by Mr. Himanshu Gupta has been instrumental in changing S. Chand from being an owner-driven company to a corporate entity and decentralizing its operations. This same year, he led the company into signing an agreement with Ingenatic Germany to promote simulation-based blended learning solutions in India. In 2006, late Sri Rajendra Kumar Gupta was honoured posthumously with the FPBAI Lifetime Achievement Award. Addressing the needs of the 21st century students, S. Chand took two digital learning initiatives in 2007 with the launch of E-Class and Talim in partnership with the Uttaranchal government. In 2008, S. Chand entered into a joint venture with EMPGI to form S. Chand Harcourt. S. Chand Harcourt provides high-quality school digital resources, lab solutions, teacher training for professional development of teachers. Within two years, the company won eight national and three international awards for excellence. The very next year, Mr. Himanshu Gupta was joined by his brother-in-law, Mr. Dinesh Chunjanwala. Together, the pair has achieved an enviable scale of production and turnover. 2009 was also a path-breaking year in the company's printing press evolution, with its transition to computer to plate printing. 2010 saw the entry of Mr. Gaurav Junjanwala in S. Chand's Digital Ventures. This year also marked the official opening of S. Chand Harcourt's e-learning program, Destination Success, by the then HRD Minister, Shri Kapil Sibal. The program is now being successfully implemented at the Indian High School, Dubai. To fill the gap being faced by students in technical education, S. Chand EduTech was founded in 2010. The next year, the company achieved another quality milestone by becoming ISO 9001-2008 certified. Moving forward with its vision of empowering minds, S. Chand was authorized by CBSE to conduct training on continuous and comprehensive evaluation in CBSE-affiliated schools. S. Chand went on to acquire 51% stake in BPI, becoming a majority stakeholder. 2012 saw S. Chand take a giant leap forward with the acquisition of Vikas Publishing House with its imprint Madhuban. This acquisition negotiated by Everstone Capital was the most important strategic decision taken by the S. Chand family during the past 75 years. The same year, Mr. Himanshu Gupta received the Young Publisher Award from the Federation of Educational Publishers in India. He went on to be elected Vice President of the Federation of Indian Publishers in the year 2013. Under the dynamic leadership of Mr. Dinesh Chunjanwala and Mr. Himanshu Gupta, the company has gone from being S. Chand to the S. Chand group of companies. In keeping with the current global trends in education, it has transformed itself into Knowledge Corporation. Today, 75 years later, S. Chand has around 12,000 titles and a pool of 3,000 authors. It has more than 30 offices across the country and employee strength of 2,000 plus. Building strong partnerships and alliances across the globe, S. Chand targets to become the largest academic book player in Asia in the next five years. S. Chand is well known for the quality of its working relationships with its authors. 
the company has geared forward strongly with the pride, commitment, passion and integrity of its employees. Promoting Indian education and culture, S. Chand founded Shyamlal College, Delhi, currently celebrating its Golden Jubilee year, and Shyamlal Gupta Memorial Library at the American Institute of Indian Studies, Gurgaon. S. Chand, master of its own destiny, descendant of a great past, living example of a dynamic India, continues to fly the ideological flag of its founder, turning visions into reality.